there's I've a got snow. Food, food everywhere here, yeah. There's a snow, it there's is... a Christmas here. Mm. The drunken bear. Hola todos. Hello everyone, my name is Nick or Nico. My name is Rachel or Raquel. And this is Harry, aka Enrique. Mm, look at his shirt, he's got a shirt on. What do you reckon? So today is all about Chilean sweets. So we went to our favorite bakery, Marcianos, which is a Chilean bakery, and they're very famous for doing cakes and sweets, and there's just heaps of them there. We picked six, well, six of them, and we're gonna try them in front of you. Just before we start our video, please click the subscribe button. And if you want more behind the scenes footage of our channel, go to our Instagram account, which we're always updating with fun little photos. Check that out. Okay, let's get started. Let's start number one. Okay, number one. Number one is this little one here. It's a poco. Un poco. Un chiquitito. Someone is going for it. Mm. So what is this sweet? And let's taste it. Mm. Outside it's very, very soft. It's a very short breading. It's got like a caramel filling, but it's it's a very small amount of caramel. It's more like just having a shortbread biscuit. And this one is very similar. So this one here that you're looking at right now, we're gonna try it. It looks the same, but with a lot more chocolate. Here you go. Mmm, delicious! Mmm, that's better. That one. It's very similar, but it's got chocolate. It's like a chocolate shortbread. What's inside? I think caramel. Caramel! Again! Chili, Chileans love caramel, it seems. So we're going to go for another one, which is a massive one. Ah, that's for me! Okay, you, you're going to have to do this one on your own. Well, caramel cake. It's like a sponge cake kind of vibe. But you know, but sponge cake has too much, too much dough, too much, um, not in, not enough filling. Mm. But this one has what? at least about. Plenty of caramel. Mm. Mm, so yum. caramel is really big here as well too, but. It's always salted caramel. Always. It's just, it's very hard to get normal caramel anymore. It's just, everything is salted caramel. So I'm wondering, over in your country where you live, is salted caramel big? Is it famous? Is it big in Chile? Because it's really big here, but Chileans definitely seem to love their caramel. I remember when I went to visit in the supermercado, um, in the supermarket in Chile, they had like manjar, which is like the caramel Caramel spread. It's like how we always have peanut butter, but over there they seem to have um, caramel on toast and stuff. So, yeah, it's quite interesting. A good place to live if you like caramel, I think. Mm. Nickel's time, please. Mmm. That's better because it's kind of softer. Yeah. It's More caramel. A, yeah, exactly the mm. same as the first one, but this one has a bit crispy texture outside. Yeah, it's crispier and it's thinner mm. and more caramel, so it's perfect. I reckon that's that's the one for me. <gasps> so what? Actually, let's go with this one. That seems. Mm. Again, shortbread and caramel seems to be the theme for Chilean sweets. Mm. And uh, they love icing, I think. Mm. They seem to like icing. Yeah, me first this time. Mmm. That is I've got. Oh my god, there is I've a got snow! Food, food everywhere, yeah, yeah. There's a snow, it there's is... a Christmas here! Mm. It's very nice. Honestly, this is the best shortbread. Mm, um, I've ever had. Ever? It's very buttery. Very buttery, 
but I don't know why. It's soft. Soft? Maybe it's less sweet. Mm. It's less sweet, softer. It just crumbles into your mouth and kind of melts in your what mouth. What is this? Yeah. Mm. It melts so in your mouth. So good. And just adding can't that. Can't believe it. Adding that little bit of icing on the top too. Okay. Okay, the last one. This is for you. This is the love heart one. Look at that. This is for you. Ta -da -da. Love heart for you. Ta -da -da. Ooh, crunchy. I can hear the crunch. I had this one a long time ago, when I was younger. Many, many years ago. I don't know what it's called. It's very damn similar to a Korean snack. Mmm. Mmm. I don't get how I've made it, but it's... It's kind of like a glazed puff pastry. Is that the best kind of... Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I can't believe it. It's just almost to taste the same as Korean snack, mm. which is this. I don't know if you haven't had this Korean snack, please have this. It's just really, I don't know, it reminds me of the Korean snack so much. All right, they were all the sweets. Uh, let us know in the comments below. Have you ever had any of those sweets before? What are they called? What do you think they taste like? Are they yummy? Do they look like any sweets that you have in your country? Um, that was really delicious. It yeah, was yummy. It's really good. Chileans do some good sweets. Today's question is what is the dessert in your country? Um, it doesn't belong to only Chileans or Chile. It's for everyone. Please comment below what is your favorite dessert? We have a little bit of habit of having dessert after dinner. We call it dizzy. Dizzy. Hmm, it's a bad habit because um, we have a lot of junk dessert, like chocolate and all that kind of thing. Yeah. It's a very bad habit. We used to have fruit a lot, but we kind of, every now and again we have fruit, but very rarely now. I'd love to have fruits as a dessert. So when it comes to my favorite dessert, tea and bickies, you can't go wrong. Um, doesn't really matter what kind of bickies, but just having tea and bickies is fun. It's like a little event. I like it. Um, yeah, for him, honey. Honey. Thank you for watching this video. Please give it a like if you liked this video. Mm. And subscribe too, just from this button. Also, does anyone remember his name of this bear? That's the other secret question. Let us know down below. Do you remember his name? <laughs> It's not osito. Okay, adios. Ciao, ciao. Yeah. Nos vemos, muchachos y muchachas. Bye. Bye, everyone.